a networks question based upon pure aloha access control mechanism here we are using pure aloha for transmission where each frame is of length 1000 bits so the length of frame is given as 1000 bits the channel transmission rate or you can say the bandwidth it is given as 1 mbps and here it is 1 megabits per second not the bytes the aggregate number of transmissions across all the nodes including the new frame transmissions and the retransmitted frames due to collisions so here we don't have to consider the retransmitted frames uh, once again they are already included in this so this thing is modeled as a portion process with a rate of 1000 frames per second which means in one second there are in total 1000 frames being generated and that includes both the new frames as well as the retransmitted frames so if in one second we are having this much we have to actually determine the throughput the definition has been given it is defined as average number of frames successfully transmitted per second so this 1000 is the number of frames we are trying to transmit or we are generating actually in one second but throughput will be the number of average number of frames that are successfully transmitted per second so that is what we need to find out so coming here in one second we are generating thousand frames so in one transmission time in one unit of transmission delay what is the number of frames that will be transmitting let us find out that for that we will first need to find out the transmission time or you can say the time it takes to transmit one frame that will be given as the length of frame upon bandwidth so it will be 1000 which is the length upon bandwidth that is 10 to the power 6 megabits per second so this gives 1 by 10 cube seconds or you can say 1 milliseconds so the transmission delay is 1 millisecond hence in one second if we are able to generate 1000 frames then in one milliseconds we will be able to generate exactly one frame dividing both these sides by 1000 which means in one transmission delay we can transmit one frame and in case of pure aloha what do we define this g as this factor g it is the average number of frames in one particular frame transmission delay the average number of frames that we attempt to transmit so if this is modeled as a poisson process then we will be able to say that the throughput for this is it will be given as g times of e raised to minus 2 g and for this case the value of g is simply 1 just because in this case the transmission time is 1 so the value of g also becomes 1 for this pure alpha and hence if we calculate the value of this it will become g which is 1 then that times of e raised to minus 2 then this g is again 1 so this is simply 1 by e square what is this e it is the Euler's number you can say the Euler's quotient or that thing whose value becomes 2.7 something so when we do this e squared and after calculating this thing it turns out to be 0.1354 something and we are asked this was for one millisecond or for the one transmission time itself but we want throughput which is defined in per second so this was in one millisecond so when that is mapped to one second then it would become 0 0.1354 times of 10 cube which gives 135.4 and we'll be rounding it off to 135 so that will be the actual throughput which means in one second 1000 frames were being generated but only 135 out of them are being successfully transmitted so throughput for this pure alpha system would become simply 135 so that would be the answer